Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, hi, my name is Madison and I am a new grad nurse. I am waiting to take my NCLEX, so I guess I'm not technically a nurse yet, but I am fresh out of nursing school. I've been sharing my whole entire nursing college experience on my YouTube channel here and I'm so excited. This is going to be a productive study day in my life, what I'm doing to study for the NCLEX and hopefully this will help you guys be productive to study for your NCLEX or just study or just really just do anything productive because I don't always have productive days but I know when I watch other people be productive it makes me want to be productive but before we get started I wanted to thank Princess Polly for sponsoring today's video I have a 20% off discount code which I'm going to put right here it is Madison M for 20% off your Princess Polly order so Princess Polly ships from within the US and they also have free express shipping for orders over $50 Princess Polly also offers shop pay and after pay to all of their US customers as well, which is awesome. And again, you guys, I have a 20% off discount code, which is Madison M for 20% off your Princess Polly order. I'm going to have all the information down below as well as right here. And I'm going to show you guys some of my favorite pieces that I got from Princess Polly. I've been wanting a headband that like Velcros for the longest time that I just wrap around my head and goes on. And I've been using this to like do face masks and stuff and it's this light baby pink it says princess polly on it and it also comes with a little face sponge to like remove your makeup next i got these pink flower earrings and if you saw my last video where i did a princess polly haul i think it was in december i got these exact earrings in green for the holidays and i'm so excited for these pink ones you guys know pink is my favorite color and i feel like these look really cute maybe stacked with the green ones so i'm so excited and it's um obviously this baby pink and I'm excited because I want to wear them to work for you know the little baby girls you guys know it would not be a princess poly haul without sunglasses I am so excited for these sunglasses I saw them I was like I have to have them they are like I don't have anything like this and it's kind of like tan on the side and we have this like green like frame and it's so cute I love it I definitely like them more like down like this super cute super cute on top of the head as well i'm super excited to take these to the beach and i got this hat and it's this really pretty blue and it just says palm springs usa it's like a super fun casual hat perfect for the beach and i'm so excited about this hat it has a smiley face on it and it's like a pink trucker hat it is so cute oh my gosh and the smiley face it screams summer and the beach and i just love everything about this hat the last accessory that i got i'm actually wearing it is these earrings and they come with a bunch of like mix mix and match earrings and they're so cute i have them all like stacked here they're just so pretty and i love the look of like a bunch of different earrings it's perfect i love it but i am going to go ahead and get into the clothing pieces from princess polly so the first piece is obviously the shirt that i'm wearing right now and this is perfect for valentine's day and this shirt is literally perfect for valentine's day it's this beautiful like corset top and it has a little triangle it comes down at the bottom like this and it is so so cute i love it it's super comfortable and it's so pretty and i feel like you could wear it with so many different pieces which is always always a plus so speaking of valentine's day i am so excited about this sweater my sister's obsessed with it she's going to be borrowing it for work um it is so cute it's just this beautiful sweater and it like buttons if you want to button it do i need to say anything this is the shirt i was most excited about it screams maddie it's pink and glittery so pretty like i cannot get over this shirt i want it in like a dress form like it's so beautiful i love it and lastly we are ending with something super cozy i love this i this i can see this on the beach this outfit so it's actually a two-piece um outfit so it comes with it's kind of like crocheted and you have like two different colors of like tan some cream and white and the sleeves are like this super fun and then the shorts you guys are so cute this outfit is so comfortable and i could just see this on the beach hair wavy 
it's perfect i'm so excited and it's so 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 comfortable thank you again princess polly for sponsoring this video i absolutely love princess polly and it's just such an honor to work with them i know you guys will love them too again i have a 20 percent off discount code for you guys and it's just madison m to get 20 percent off your next princess polly order good morning you guys i look so greasy it's my alarm um, we're having a productive study day today, so I'm about to get up, grab a coffee, and we're gonna get our day started. Um, and yeah, we're gonna be studying for the NCLEX today, and yeah, I look so greasy. Alright, let's get up and get some coffee and be productive, so let's go. Can I get a medium iced coffee with extra cream and sugar? Okay. Could I also do a wake up wrap with egg and cheese? Or of hash browns, chocolate glazed, and five glazed munchkins? We're gonna make the bed because it's like so we don't get back in it yeah okay so I like washed my bedding the other day and I just love fresh bedding crazy like one's further because I have five pillows instead of six but that's okay I'm gonna fold this also I get questions on where I got my bedding the bedding is Martha Stewart and I got it I think from home goods it was either Marshall's or home goods I'm almost positive it was home goods and it's Martha Stewart bedding and it's like flowers on one side and the other is like plaid so if you wanted to like look for it and then I got this cute double-sided blanket from Home Goods. It's like pink and then like orange on the other side. Look at this pillow my sister got me from Target two days ago. Oh my gosh. And it like matches with my room perfectly. So I feel like I want to keep it even when it's not Valentine's Day. But it's so cute. So she's going to sit right here. I love her. Having a clean study space, you guys already know, is like helps me focus, get prepared and in the zone so what we're gonna do now is we are gonna set up at my desk and um this is where i've been working this is where all the magic and knowledge is happening Right, you guys so this is the setup obviously my computer i have where i've been taking like notes i'll do a whole video and stuff on like where i got this what i'm using blah 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 right now today i'm using doing the mark lamech lectures um and my goal is to be done with them on sunday so today i'm doing lectures four and five and yeah i'm gonna do that on my laptop i got my water all my like supplies that i need and we are ready to go also, you guys, look at my new skincare wall. I'm obsessed with it. I did a TikTok video on it, and I'm just literally obsessed with it. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get to studying.
right, so I'm about to listen to my lecture. I am on lecture number four, and these notes are from, I think her name is Darian. I watched her um, YouTube videos, and she linked, like, I don't know if it was her or one of her friends, like, made notes from um, Mark K's lecture. So I, like, printed these out, double-sided, and then I've just been taking... Like my own notes and highlighting these as well as taking additional notes on scrap paper so i'll put her video down below where she like linked it i'm also going to buy U world today i wanted to do that sooner but time has seemed to slip so yeah i'm gonna start here i'm doing weeks four and five today so four is crutches canes and walkers and lecture five is diabetes breakdowns um it's hard you know i mean i know i'm new i don't have any friends yet or anything on the floor um it's hard remembering people's names um i am the youngest one on the floor too so that's kind of tough a lot of them are older and have kids or grandkids and are married and it's just it's like tough i feel very out of place i feel I have like a lot of anxiety when I go to work too. Um, and I guess what I have to say and what my parents keep telling me and like my friends and my family is like never stop being you and never stop being kind to people even if people are being rude to you. But you also need to like set boundaries and make sure people know that they can't treat you poorly or be rude to you just because you are a new grad or you're younger than them or you have less experience it doesn't make them better than you like they may have more knowledge and experience but it doesn't make them better than you and i guess it kind of just goes back to the thing like i always say like i don't care who you are what you do for example in a hospital setting whether you are an it person housekeeping you work in the kitchen you're a top surgeon a nurse a doctor pt rt OT. I don't care. I'm going to treat every single person the same because at the end of the day, like just because you have certain education or letters after your name, like who cares? Like we're all people, we're all humans and everyone needs to be treated the same. And I think that like new grad nurses, like everyone starts somewhere. And I just like think like, do people like think they were just came out of the womb being a nurse and that they don't have to respect new nurses or forget that they were there i don't know so it's been it's been tough but i know it's probably going to be like this anywhere sadly um so yeah i just wanted to i guess update you guys on that i just finished lecture four and that was on like mobility and gait crutches canes and walkers and then we it went into like psych stuff which not the best at um with like psychosis and stuff but the next lecture at five is on diabetes so what i'm gonna do is take a break here so i'm gonna take a break i'm gonna kind of tidy up my space so it is clean and it'll be more of like a fresh start for the next lecture if that makes sense so i'm just gonna put this all away i mean i really just have to put these all in here and then i'll be ready to go and prepare for a fresh start once I'm done with my break. Sorry, my phone's going off. Okay. And then we'll start lecture five. Right here. Okay. And I've just been putting like little sticky notes when the lectures start and I'll like tape it so it stays. So I have this and then 
these right here. I'm also gonna oops, plug in my laptop and let it charge. And I'm done with these pages, so I can put those away in my binder. And then I also made a list of like stuff I want to review. I just started it like crutch stuff because oh my gosh, that is a lot for me that I was. I don't know. It's kind of confusing. I need to watch like a video or something. So five. So my break is done. My break lasted longer than I wanted to, or I planned, but I got stuck on my phone doing some work that I needed to get done for YouTube. And then I did a quick ab workout, showered, and I got, sorry, I like just ran up the stairs, I'm out of breath. Blackberries, sorry Xander's screaming. Um, peanut butter on a rice cake, and then the, I can't believe it's not butter, spray butter. I like one salty, one sweet, but I have an hour left. I think this lecture is like an hour and four minutes. I just need to get it done because sometimes I stop, take little notes. Okay, this one's an hour and 11 minutes. So I'm going to push through and I can be done by like 640. If I can do that. sorry it's dark out so my lighting is yellow from my makeup mirror but I added on my little list here we have crutches and insulins to go over um, here I just have like my little additional notes that's that and then I'll just flip through and show you guys what we have so far kind of like with stuff I added or highlighted. You guys know I love highlighting and color and sticky notes and everything like that. So that's kind of what I've been doing and I am right here. So I'm going to do lectures six and seven tomorrow. So what I like to do is again tidy up my space and I'm just going to use some Windex, spray my desk so it's nice and clean for tomorrow. No fingerprints, no crumbs, nothing like that. So I'm just gonna push my chair in because I'm done for the night. I'm just gonna wipe this down so I literally, oh, I don't need my little coaster anymore. So I have like a nice, fresh, clean space for tomorrow and it's not like cluttered with everything from the previous day. So I'm gonna do that. And ready, ready to be another productive day sitting at my desk. Once we're done studying for the day, I'm gonna wind down. So right now it's seven o'clock and I am going, I'm going over my boyfriend's, but I'm just gonna do my skincare and stuff here because I'm not taking 510 things over there. I'm taking this ordinary glycolic acid toning solution. Looks like this. My sister said it's like supposed to be good for um, like, darkness and like miscoloration on like your underarms and bikini line area so i don't know i'll have to let oh it burns i got it on my i have like a cut my lip and i just got it on my lip um close my mouth this time go down my neck and i'm just oh, i need to put deodorant on oh well i'll just wipe it off and put it back on i'm just going like over here yeah Good enough. Okay. So I've been trying out like new skincare and stuff. So I'll let you know if I see any changes. But I'm just going to be putting on a bunch of other stuff now. But I'm going to end this video here. 
I love you guys so much. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Um, make sure you guys check out Princess Polly and use my discount code. I'll leave everything below for you guys. But if you're not already, make sure you subscribe. Say 80,000 subscribers, which is crazy. I'm just one step closer to 100K. So make sure you guys subscribe if you're not already. Give this video a thumbs up. It helps me a lot. And if you're interested, follow me on my social medias, which I'll have down below. I love you guys so much. I hope you're all doing well. And I'll see you guys in my next video.